Yo, 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 my people. Today we're gonna be building in Bloxburg, but it's not just any build. I'm kind of doing a collab with myself. I posted a poll on my gaming Instagram account and I posted another poll on my crochet Instagram account. And on both of them, I told everyone to pick one. On my gaming account, the options were bedroom, house exterior, and 3D model. And then on my crochet account, the options were bunny, mushroom, pickle, and turtle. And this might all seem so random, but I sell my crochet plushies in a physical store. And last week, my bunny cozy stress pets, small mushroom boys, pickles, and baby turtles sold. And I want to restock them this week. So in Bloxburg, I'm going to build what one on my gaming accounts poll, but the theme will be the plushie that won on my crochet poll. And then I'm also going to be making like a short form video of me crocheting the plushie that won on my crochet pole. Now, drum roll please for the results. We're gonna be building a bunny bedroom, woohoo! <laughs> Y'all, I need to do a video of deleting plots because I realize that there's a lot that I'm ready to just get rid of, but we're gonna be getting rid of this one. If you wanna see the video, this is my 10K budget house. Cause as you'll probably see today, I, I do, do not, not budget, budget ever. ever. So this was a rough one for me, but goodbye to you. And I have absolutely no thoughts in my head about how this is gonna go <laughs> at all. <laughs> one thought I'm having is that I could like kind of emulate the shape of the plushie that I'm gonna be crocheting, but it wouldn't actually be completely emulated. I would don't want it to be like a full on octagon. Is that what it would be? And this is kind of small, but you know what? It's a bedroom and I'm gonna work with it. Roof for roof. Oh, you know, will a hollow mansard work on here? It totally will. Cause then I can do some fun stuff inside. Oh my gosh, I was like, what is that door? It's the broken door. I haven't really been here since before this update. Ooh, okay. The more I'm going, which I haven't really done much, but the more I do move, and do things and get more ideas. Wait, I didn't know we got new horizontal planks. What? And vertical, bless. I won't be using those though because for me, my default color for bunnies is white and I actually don't know at all what color of my bunny cozy stress pets sold last week. That's one thing I need to fix in like how I tag my items. But I'm just gonna make this white. I don't know what color I'm gonna be crocheting yet. The build is coming before the plushie. Okay, and don't mind me using like smooth plastic for everything right now. It's not my usual go-to. Okay, I don't think I've really played around with these half spheres, but I'm gonna see if I can like turn this, oh my gosh, into a bunny ear. That tells me that maybe I can. <gasps> okay, I can. It's gonna be a simple one if I do that, but it works, y'all, it works. And no, I did not really intend <laughs> to do an exterior with this. The focus, you know, since it's a bedroom, is the bedroom, the inside, but can you blame me for wanting to do something like this? I don't think you can. Now, this will not look like my actual plushie, but I'm wondering if I can do like a little pink, a little pink part. Oh my gosh, I think this is gonna look beautiful. Ah! Oh my gosh, yes. <laughs> okay, so far it doesn't feel like much. I'm not sure whether I'm gonna do much more on the outside or not. Cause again, the focus is the inside, right? But we got a little something and do you see how it like kind of resembles <laughs> my plushie? Like it's got the ears, it's got like the rounded shape in the front at least. And then like, you know, these windows are like kind of the eyes. And then we've got these little planters by the windows that are kind of like blush. And I don't know, you could even say like this door is like the nose. But when I was putting it there, I was thinking more of like a little pink belly. I don't know if any of that makes sense, but there we go. <laughs> now for the actual interior of the bedroom. It's so weird having not built in so long. Like I'm having to re-remember re re everything and it is not easy, let me tell you. Oh my gosh, even this old mattress. <laughs> I haven't seen any of this stuff. Wait, what? Wooden pallet, double bed. <gasps> Wait, I actually love this. I mean, I wish the pallets looked a little bit better, but like this is what I actually want in real life. <laughs> Currently my bed is just on the floor, which is like second best thing, but wait, okay. I love that this bed fits so nicely there. I was gonna have it facing like this way and I want a double bed, but it just looks better with that space. But this is even better. It can be like a little, a little bed nook. <gasps> Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I love when I build and then ideas come to me. Like sometimes it's okay not knowing what you're doing when you go into it because you figure it out as you go, duh. Oh my gosh, I forgot we had the vaulted ceilings. Wait, this makes us even better, what? Okay, let's finally get some kind of bunny action going in here. I'm gonna build this bed head a little bit of ways from the actual bed. That's definitely way too big because it has to be one tile wide. Oh my gosh, wait, I can just put this right on the bed. I love that these half spheres 
those are just like the right shape for bunny ears. It's so, it's just so nice, you know? <laughs> okay, that's definitely giving bunny vibes. Hold on. Oh my gosh, I was not gonna do like a face or anything, but now I really really want to and these half spheres are just saving the day today <laughs> we got a bunny going okay and as a crochet plushie maker omegarumist you could say i can never get away from wanting to do blush ah see that just adds so much cuteness okay i have been working on just making this bed cozy cozy and cute but meanwhile we don't even have like a colored floor or walls and i don't know what to do <laughs> maybe we could do some more windows in here and i honestly want a moment for this chair in here although given the vaulted ceilings it doesn't make sense and here i am i just remembered i was supposed to be doing the walls and the floors and then i was like let's add a chair what <laughs> that's not walls so start with some trim usually that comes last but i feel like we need it to really define what we're doing in here okay let me see if i can do this wardrobe here and then still fit a desk in this space over here okay i'm gonna say that that works Ooh, and before i get too far ahead of myself i want to do one of my favorite things ever oh except it barely is gonna fit on this wall erg in this desk because in the way get out of the way dusk okay that still does the trick Woo! i love a bedroom taking shape and meanwhile i still haven't really done the walls <laughs> or floor i feel like this is such a different vibe from my normal builds i mean i say that but i'm gonna undo the curtains because i don't like them but still this feels so different to me but like i love it but also it's been so long since i have really built that maybe my style has really changed who knows? Ugh, I'm not feeling any curtains. I think I need to do blinds. That way the windows still feel very open. Okay, I need to see if I can build myself a little version of my plush for the game. Of the plushie that started it all. I don't know, the dimensions, the proportions might be a little bit off. And I can tell you, just based on the shape of this ear, it's definitely not going to be nearly as cute as the real thing. I feel like these are looking more like cat ears than bunny ears. And I don't know if I'm going to be able to make eyes small enough with this sphere here or half sphere okay it's gonna have some bigger eyes but it's cute it makes it cute which is something i tend to notice with my plushies because sometimes i'll decide to use a certain size of eyes with a certain plushie like every time and then after a while i'll just try like the next size up and i'm like wait that is so much cuter <laughs> okay i can't put a nose on like i want to you know what? let me try one more thing i was getting ready to give up <laughs> and just not mm, no that's gonna be way too way too big Okay, you're not getting a nose bunny. Sorry. <gasps> I just realized I don't think I'm going to be able to move this because of the eyes. Mm. I might have ruined this for myself. See what I mean? I can move the body, but the eyes are still there. <laughs> that sucks. Okay, well, I'm going to have to be happy with that placement somehow then. Ooh, I like this new set of books. Oh, they're so cute. Yes, those colors are everything. We have this mirror here, but I feel like we still need a full length mirror in this room. Okay, and I'm actually living for how big this mirror is i don't know if i've ever realized that it's that big and this is my favorite thing to do with these mirrors is to give them a little curve like that <gasps> how did i forget about our new plants oh my gosh i'm obsessed but you know what else we need in here to really sell the bunny theme we need some carrots of course Worse. Is that a little bit too much? I don't know. I, I'm kind of feeling it. Y'all, I've like almost thoroughly decorated this room, yet I still haven't done the walls. What is wrong with me? Tell me why I actually kind of like the dirt stain color. Like it kind of looks like, I don't know, some kind of fancy high-end wallpaper. Like, does that, do you know what I mean? Like, I don't know. <laughs> I might sound really crazy right now. Alrighty, y'all. Our bunny-themed bedroom is finally complete. Thank you to everyone who voted on Instagram. You had no idea what I was doing, but this is the final result of it. I didn't end up doing anything else on the outside. As you can see, again, the inside is what matters. So let's see that inside. Woo! I am so happy with how this turned out. Do you see this place? I think it's cute. I would absolutely love to live in this room, to be honest. I feel like you can't see this decal well, but it's a bunch of little bunnies. Alrighty, y'all. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching it. I love you all so much, and I will see you next time. Bye!